So by the time I upload this video, everything is going to come out as a lie, but until then, I must fill the void because apparently yesterday it was announced through one of Aiden Ross's fan accounts that he was done streaming after his cake contract expired. They even posted this novel thinking I'm going to read it all. I did, but this has to be the most un Aiden Ross thing I've ever read. First of all, they use the word camaraderie. There is no way in fuck that this guy knows how to use the word camaraderie in a sentence. And just listen to this one section and you tell me if this is something Aiden Ross would say. Of course, none of this would have been possible without the support of my family and friends. You've been my rock through it all, encouraging me to chase my dreams and never give up. Your belief in me has been my greatest source of strength and I am blessed to have you by my side. That's something Aiden would be like, what are you gay? Did you just call me your rock? What are you, a fucking girl? What are you gay? Not even that, you could say all of this for the first sentence where he says, today I stand before you with a heart full of gratitude and a head full of memories as I embark on this journey called retirement. All right, fucking Shakespeare, just a couple months ago, you couldn't even have a proper conversation with someone. Can I ask you a question? What? I'm not trying to get too personal, but like, are you and your girlfriend good now? Uh, it's complicated, but we're, we're, we're on good terms, better terms than we were last week. I mean, is that your person? Is that a person? Yeah. No, your person, your person. What does it mean? Is, 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 is that? Person, your person. Is that person my person? I mean, I, I... Is your girlfriend your person? Oh, oh, I don't know what that means. Now, like I said, this is more than likely just a plan to build up some hype for something he's about to do because this isn't supposed to happen for at least two to three more years. And I'm not talking about his retirement, but I'm talking about just Aiden leaving in general so that they can get a more respectable person to take his spot. And I know, respectable person on Kick, and you guys gotta understand that Kick is still trying to figure out who they are and they weren't. They once were the bad boys who let anything slide until they realized that that also meant illegal shit. And who are they kidding. Aiden needs to stream to be able to afford everything he has. You don't go from basically the peak of your career and then just quit and expect to live the same way. Don't get me wrong, he has made a lot of money, but it's nowhere near enough where he can just retire from streaming cold turkey. For a couple years maybe, even a few more after that. But unless our economy gets hit with a fucking time machine, then we're all gonna be like, you don't throw the time machine, you were supposed to put the economy in the time machine and send it back and you're gonna be like, oh well fuck, it broke. I guess you gotta keep streaming. Fuck it. You, but it should have been more clear. We, we had one time machine. What do you think of fuck? You think time machines just come in abundance like that? And it's not like he's known for anything else. Famous people aren't gonna want to hang out with him anymore if it means that they can't get some exposure from him. That's like 80% of the reason these celebrities are hanging out with him. Their manager's just like, you just gotta sit there for an hour and I promise you'll see a boost in sales. They don't even gotta talk to him. You can just sit there and ignore him for all he cares. You don't even have to be there. He can just pay you and you don't even show up. It's happened before, my other client did it to him. And maybe him being gone is his way of spreading himself out because even he knows that we need a little break from him every once in a while. You know, like make them start the fiend for your return. It's already happening if you think about it. The guy running this account who posted Aiden's supposed retirement message is going crazy. The one guy who he has dedicated his whole life to just went ghost, so now he has to make up things because just like the real Aiden, we would forget he even existed in as little as a week after he stops posting. I know I can speak for a lot of people when I say that I didn't even know Aiden hadn't streamed for a week before this message was posted. When your whole career is just being involved in controversies that shouldn't get as big as they do, when those stories stop popping up, we don't ask what happened, we just bask in the blissfulness that is you not being there. And even when he's not here, he's still a fucking nuisance to people because apparently someone was pretending to be him, meaning they used a pre-recorded stream to make others break their things, thinking he was going to pay them like he's done before. Oh right, yeah, yeah, I'm ready. It looks already broken though. Wait, do more, 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 more. It looks broken though. Do the TV, do the TV, do the TV. They show Eden. Yeah. Uh, oh. oh, God. Oh, break it right now. Your phone, just break it. Yeah, break it now. Break it then. 
Now, of course, this is 100% the fault of the person who thinks a video where the audio never matches up is real, but you see what I mean? This guy could retire, but because of how his personality was, people can literally manipulate others because that is something he does to his fans normally. It might not always be breaking something or driving your car into a lake, but he's been able to make people do things just because he tells them to and or offer them money. Either way, I'm hoping this retirement is real so that way Cheezer can become the new leader so I start a movement where everyone calls him Cheese Dick. But yeah guys, like I said, by the time this goes out, this could all be resolved and we were fooled once again by the man who tried and convinced a lot of people that he was going to interview Kim Jong-un. If I am right, then happy retirement, you piece of shit. Good riddance and goodbye. Like that rapper you listen to. Juicebox. See you guys tomorrow. Peace.